Wild Talents, by Charles Hoyfort, Chapter 10c. I have come upon many allusions to the leopard men and the hyena men of African tribes, but the most definite story that I know of is an article by Richard Baggett in the Cornhill Magazine, October 1918, upon the alleged powers of natives of northern Nigeria to take on the forms of lower animals. An experience attributed to Captain Shot, distinguished service order, is told of. It is said that raiding hyenas had been wounded by gun traps, and in each case had been traced to a point where the hyena tracks had ceased, and had been succeeded by human footprints, leading to a native town. A particular of the traditional werewolf story is that when a werewolf is injured, the injury appears upon a corresponding part of the human being of its origin. Baggett told of Captain Shot's experience, alleged experience, whatever, with one enormous brute that had been shot and had made off, leaving tracks that were followed. The hunters came to a spot where they found the jaw of the animal lying in a pool of blood. The tracks went on toward a native town. The next day a native died. His jaw had been shot away.